before we get into the workout today, usually I like to start with uh, eating some oatmeal. Um, also eating some eggs. These two I go with every morning before I get into a workout. Um, great combination, man. For those of y'all don't like oatmeal, y'all are crazy, bro. Oatmeal is good. I eat this all day, every day. When I eat this, I really like to go for two cups now since uh, I started lifting more. And usually I eat two eggs, but I moved up to three. So I have three eggs, two cups of oatmeal, and then drink some water. And then after that, just get straight into the workout. I got the oatmeal in the uh, microwave. I'm gonna go ahead and thrash these eggs, bro. Come on, y'all. Gotta eat y'all eggs in the morning. Just gotta get that protein in there, man. Oh, and another thing, eat your fruits, too. I don't have any more fruits, I ran out, but I usually eat bananas before I get a workout in, too, so. Also, get your fruits, water, that's the key. So, Basically, they got some stuff going on in the hills, man. They got disc golf. Man, what is disc golf? So, we're not gonna do no hill workouts today. We're just gonna do some sand work in the pit, do some ball handling work, and that's pretty much it. Do some conditioning, stuff like that, get in shape. Um, we're not gonna go that hard because I still got um, lower back strains going on. I've been in the chiropractor in and out for about a couple months. So um, we're gonna do some light work, nothing too serious today. So that's, that's gonna be the plan for today.
Bruh, that's tiring. Shoot. I haven't did condition in a minute. Ever since I've been getting treatment done and being a chiropractor and stuff like that. Gee, I'm gonna be about to catch a stomach cramp. That's pretty much it for today's work. Uh, got a few drills in the sand, got some ball handling in. I wish you could have got the hills. So we can work on our, you know, bounce and everything. So probably gonna hit that another day. That's pretty much it for today's workout. Just a whole lot of work out here, man. The sand pit work ain't no joke. Sand pits ain't no joke, bruh. <laughs> Back of my thighs is burning, man. Bro, I listen to this song every day, man. Every day. That money is coming, my palms itching. I run around the bitch, see you count this money in the quickest. Run to the shit like physical fitness. Where about you, why you all in my business? Try to rob me, you gon' need some assistance. My WCW on Wings, go storm on your block, you get winded like Williams. Oh my gosh. Hey, yo, yo, yo. Shout out to my boy I, man. Shout out to my boy Isaac, man. He didn't put the boy on that song. We listen to that song every day, man. Every day. Gotta stay lit, man. You know how you have one of them songs that just get you hype every day, get you motivated to get some money or work out or do something? That's that song, bro. That's that song that put me in the mood to get right. You know, get on my grind, get this money, do whatever, work out. That's just my song, man. Me, Isaac, and Kyrie, man, we listen to that song almost every day, bro. It's crazy. But yeah, man, um, that was a slight little workout that we had i had to drop my brother off at practice so we ain't go too uh hard because i know he had practice i ain't want to get uh tired or anything so there's some light i'm supposed to take it easy anyway because i'm still going through um i'm still going through therapy and everything like that so but knowing me i want to go 100 percent so hard like i'm just one of those players man like whenever i practice i just go hard but i have to learn to i have to learn to balance it i have to learn how to balance it because i'm not fully 100 percent yet so there's certain things i can't do yet that's why i'm going back to working out once a day i'm trying to push it twice a day again but i'm not even going to rush it i want to get 100 percent before next year and that's been one of my biggest challenges this year is trying to you know work out three times a day with being hurt so i have to learn how to discipline myself and to let my body rest because when I get back to 100%, bro, I'm really gonna be back to working out three times a day. Especially with the goals and stuff I had set for myself. Uh, as y'all can see in the title, I, you know, I don't have any D1 offers right now. So that's the goal, to get a D1 offer. Multiple D1 offers to wherever I have a choice, wherever I wanna go, you know, uh, a full scholarship too. So I have to hold myself accountable to be able to work out and give it my all, you know. That goes for y'all that's watching, man. You know, anything that you want to do, go for it, man. Like, really do it to your full 100%. And just trust God throughout the whole process. You know, don't let anybody tell you you can't do something. I have everybody tell me I couldn't do it. I can't do it. But that's not up to them. Yeah, this is just advice for y'all. Not just for today, but just life in general, man. Don't, don't let anybody tell you you can't do something, bro. Even if it sounds out of this world, you know... That's not up to them, it's up to you. You know, I just have faith in God that he's gonna help me get to where I need to get. As long as I have my faith and put it in the work, that's all I need. And the support of my family and, you know, my close friends, that's that's really all I need. I'm not listening to anybody else, especially the critics like that. You know, all the haters, that should motivate you to want to prove them wrong. That's just me, that's how I feel about you know, the situation, anything. like. Anything that you want to do, it ain't got to be sports. 
As long as you have work, man, and have faith in God, you can do it. Especially in the situation that everybody thinks you're not gonna be able to do something and you prove them wrong, that's, that's the greatest feeling, man. So, that's just a little motivational speech for y'all today. I gotta get some other stuff done for my mom. So I'm gonna holler at y'all later on. What? Bro, Marky, you trash, bro. Trash. And that's gonna wrap up today's video. Uh, smash that like button, subscribe if you're new, turn post notifications on, and don't forget to follow me on social media also. And that's gonna wrap up today's video. We out. And oh yeah, I ain't forget. Danny Green, you're trash. LeBron's the GOAT. Lakers in six.